vanavond is die jaarlikse um, gala dinier van die nou Student Hungry Campaign, wat dier Prof Janssen sy kantoor hanteer word en hy self hanteer dit. En um, hoe dit werk is, ons jaarliks kies ons 100 studente, waarvoor ons geld in samel en ons geld op die studentekaart sit waarmee hulle kost kan koop. Vanavond is ons, ons baie opgewonde oor vanavond. Ons het redelijk baie mense wat saam met ons werk en wat sponsors is vir vanavond. Eerst is ons gastspreker is Nikki Abtenoor. Sy is die sielkundige met um, disability, maar sy gaan vanavond met ons gesels oor wat sy in haar leven recht kry en hoe ander mense vir haar gehelp het om te kom wat sy vandag is. Well, I think being born without arms and shortened legs, as you can imagine, back in our day, as we were joking earlier, there were no scans. So for my family, it was a huge shock to find out that I had a disability and the severity of it. Uh, there was no medical explanation for my disability. But fortunately for me, my parents believed in me. And as you can see from the video footage, I think I believed in myself. <laughs> I think giving back is something that everybody has a responsibility for in many different ways. For me, there were many people in my life that helped me get to where I am. You know, by believing in me, my parents, as you said, my friends, my teachers, the university, um, so many people um, having a bursary. Sometimes you need to ask for help. And how I could identify with the NSH students today was, I know how hard it is for them to ask for help. But I've learned wanting to be independent means that you actually need to know that asking for help and accepting help is only making you get closer to your biggest dreams and goals. And one day you can give back too, and, and that's what I'm so fortunate to be able to do now. I want to thank all of you here tonight for recognizing that what we have in our beautiful 30,000 odd students at the University of the Free State are young people who are not asking for red meat, but just asking for that additional support to be able to study without worry. When I signed the contract first with Jonathan um, to publish uh, We Need to Talk, his letters, uh, columns uh, in the Times, he said he'd publish the columns, but he wouldn't take the royalties for himself. He always said the royalties would go to No Student Hungry. And we have just come to the end of the first royalty period. And so the news was that we have 100,000 Rand in royalties for the campaign. I am so delighted to announce to you that the money pledged from this function, so the money that we all pledged on the forms, including the money raised from the auction, it's all coming to about 210,000 rands. Wow.